Sometimes you accidentally end up deleting important data or you empty your recycle bin without thinking. But don't worry, there are many ways in which you can recover your important data. In today's video, we'll be talking about how to recover deleted files from the recycle bin. Let's cover the different methods that we can use. But before we get into the video, please do subscribe to the channel for more amazing content like this. Even after you've emptied the recycle bin, there is still hope of recovering deleted files, even if the recycle bin has been completely erased. So let's look at the different methods that you can use. The first and most easiest way to recover deleted files from the recycle bin is simply by restoring them directly from the recycle bin. Here is a step-by-step -step guide of how to find the recycle bin and recover the deleted files from there. Look for the recycle bin icon on your desktop and then double click to open it. You can browse through the list of deleted files and find the ones that you want to restore. You can also sort out the files by the date that they were deleted, the size of the file, or by file name, whatever way makes it easier for you to find them. Once you've found the file that you're looking for, right click on it and then click on the restore option from the drop down menu. The file that you've selected will then automatically return to its original location and now it will be visible on your hard drive there. This method is the most effective when your recycle bin hasn't been emptied and you want to recover a deleted file without any additional software. If you have emptied out your recycle bin, it's okay, don't worry, you still have methods to recover files from an emptied recycle bin, such as using third-party software like Wondershare Recover It. Install Wondershare Recover It from the official website, make sure to install it on a drive other than where your data was lost from. Once it's installed, launch it, it will look something like this. Now select the Recycle Bin Recovery option from the main menu. The software will then automatically scan your entire recycle bin and after a few minutes it will show you how many files it can recover. Select the files or folders that you particularly want to restore and then click on the recover button. Then you can choose which location you want to recover the files to. And to be safe it's best if you set the recover location to somewhere other than the drive that the files were deleted from. If you've enabled file history in Windows, then you're in luck. File history is a building feature which automatically backs up your files to an external location. Here is how you can recover deleted files from your recycle bin using file history. Open the start menu and type file history in the search bar. From the search results, you can then select the restore your files from file history option. In the file history window, you'll be able to see a list of backups which are arranged according to date. Once you've located the correct version which you are looking for, you can then restore it by clicking on the restore option and it will recover it to its original location. System Restore is also a very powerful built-in Windows feature which can help you retrieve deleted files. It rolls back your system to an older version. It doesn't just restore the system settings but also recovers files that were there at the time as well. Here is how you can use System Restore. Press the Windows key and type create a restore point in the search bar. Now click on create a restore point and then click on system restore in the system properties window. You'll be given the option to choose the restore point from a list of saved system snapshots. Select the restore point and date where the files had not yet been deleted. Then to complete the system restore, all you have to do is follow the on-screen instructions. If you're using Windows 10, you can take advantage of the Windows File Recovery Tool. This is a command line utility which allows you to recover the files which were formatted from the drive or deleted. Here is how to do this. Download the Windows File Recovery from the Microsoft Store. Open the Windows File Recovery and run the following command. WinFR, then the letter for the drive where your file was originally located then the letter for the drive where you would like the file recovered to, forward slash N, and then a specific aspect about the file, either the file name or the file type, etc. 
After that, press enter and the Windows file recovery will begin to scan the drive for those recoverable files. This method is an incredible option for recovering deleted files from the recycle bin after they've been emptied. Another easy command prompt trick to recover files is by following these steps. Press the Windows and X key and search for command prompt and then run as administrator from the list. In the CMD window, you can write the following command. Check disk X slash F. But you have to replace the letter X with the drive name where the file was originally stored. After that, you can run this command. Attrib dash H dash R dash s forward slash s forward slash d x colon star dot star again replace the letter x with whatever drive letter is relevant to you by using this method you can recover deleted files from the recycle bin as it shows hidden files and repairs issues relative to the file structure on your drive now that you know the different ways to recover files from the recycle bin here are some tips that you can follow to try and minimize the risk of losing files in the future always have your file history for any backup solutions turned on so that you can easily restore files when you need them it's always good to review the contents of your recycle bin before you empty it. Make sure to adjust the size of your recycle bin as well so that it can hold more files. This will prevent files from being permanently deleted early. So now we've looked into the different ways to recover deleted files from the recycle bin. You can simply detect files using Windows features or you can use external software. You can use built-in features such as system restore and file history, which are usually great for most users. But if you want to do a more deep scan, you can use advanced tools like the Windows file recovery and Wondershare recover it. These tools offer additional flexibility for those difficult cases. Thanks so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, then do please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more tech tips and tutorials.